Every so often, the Ethereum blockchain hard forks. Spectra is the latest. It's the 16th of a sequence of upgrades that we've done since inception. It's both going to clean up some underlying tech debt and add a whole bunch of new features that users should be excited about. It is a big upgrade. Uh, boy, you could fit so many EIPs in this bad boy. It is just brimming with them. It's the largest Ethereum upgrade we've had so far, if you measure it in terms of number of Ethereum improvement proposals. There are three core pillars to Spectra. The first one is focused on user experience. The second one are some enhancements for the validators. And the third one is increasing the available blob space. With Pectra, the user experience has never been better. In particular, it has some of the biggest wallet impacting improvements that the Ethereum protocol has ever taken on. EIP 7702 lets us bring smart contract features to existing accounts that opt in kind of in flight. It's going to facilitate a lot of uh, use cases that people have wanted for some time. Scheduled payments, push payments. Gas abstraction. Gas sponsorship. Gasless transactions, batch transactions, cross-chain abstraction. Services where the user delegates some authority to do something to a service or a bot. We will now be able to apply social recovery to Ethereum accounts. We are going to be able to have both signature signing on the protocol level. And also, we're going to be able to have fine-grained access control on the accounts. All those types of things are coming in through the smart account functionality, which is enabled through the account extraction hard fork improvement that's being included in Pectra. A lot of the things that we've added in Pectra are things to allow people to maintain their stake more effectively. It allows you to now stake 2048 ETH on a validator where previously you could only stake 32 ETH. For small validators, for solo stakers who only have 30 or 50 ETH or some number like that, their ETH can compound as they stake in the protocol. On the other side, for institutional stakers, it means that they can have fewer uh, boxes to stake all their ETH. And so being able to consolidate them into, into larger and larger stake should not only make their operational needs a little bit easier, but it should also make the P2P network have to chatter a lot less. Early 2024, we introduced the concept of blobs to Ethereum. And this is a new way to store data coming from layer two rollups on the layer one blockchain. Previously, our blob target was three blobs per block. Now our blob target is going to be six blobs per block. We're effectively doubling the scalability throughput. It allows builders to build viral apps that can scale to tens and hundreds of thousands of transactions per second while still leveraging the security and decentralization that Ethereum offers. You already have in Ethereum the foundation of being able to support a highly available, dependable settlement layer that has not had any downtime in the last 10 years since inception. Right? That's a very strong property to build off of. If you think about where this is relative to the scale of the global financial system, we're really at fractions of a percentage maybe fractions of a basis point. Consensus has been a really key part of the Petra upgrade. It's been really great to see across the company how we've really engaged with it. I think what's been really exciting about Petra is seeing the amount of core developers and, and, and other people involved in the ecosystem that are so keen to drive Ethereum forward. As we kind of shift into a new gear with onboarding institutions in a new way, now is not the time for Ethereum to slow down. It's time to accelerate and evolve things so that it can be the best that it can be. For institutions watching the unfolding of Pectra, they'll be able to see that Ethereum is being pragmatic with its roadmap, focusing on scalability, focusing on accessibility and therefore when they're choosing a platform to build on they'll know that ethereum is the best platform for them to build on as it's going to continue to be able to evolve over time to meet their needs